In Provence, the country where the sun takes over, the boxwood curtain is an indispensable element of the house. Marie-Claude Brochet makes them in a workshop in Montfavet in the memory of her grandfather, who used to turn boxwood beads. Bead after bead, the curtains are created entirely by hand in the true artisan tradition. What are you doing here, Laurence? I'm making Alors, a long chain to be cut up into the correct lengths for the height of the curtain. Pour pouvoir les couper aux dimensions voulues à la oui. hauteur de, du rideau. Ça, le, That's le, the simple le design. Simple. Oh, oui, là, oui. Yes, this is the simplest motif. It gets more complicated when you have coloured beads. Avec de couleurs, yes, because you have a design. We do a pot of you, a pot of lavender and geometry. How many metres is it possible to do in a day? In a day I can make a curtain depending on its size. A small curtain we can do in half a day, six hours. Sinon, des petits rideaux, on les fait... Oui, une journée, euh, la moitié d'une journée, oui. Me, I worked a lot with my grandfather when I was young. The firm closed a long time ago. When the summer comes in Provence, everyone asks for someone to make tea curtains. So when my children grew up, I had more time. I decided to start up again. The curtain in Provence hangs over the open door inside. It starts in the spring. Oui. It stops the insects oui. getting in and keeps the heat mm -hmm. out. And it stops people oui. looking in. That's because you always have the door open. Oui. Yes, we're going to start working in the winter with some interior design for cupboard doors and bees bees. That sounds very agreeable. The son is very agreeable. We have lots of clients who buy curtains because it reminds them of their childhood. Who makes the beads for you? I work with someone who's an artisan turner. How much does a big curtain like that cost? To give you a rough figure, a curtain which is 90 centimeters wide and 2 meters high would cost 225 euros. The boxwood comes from the forest and it's very old. It has a minimum of 25 millimeters in diameter before it's cut. We cut and then we cut them and we cut them. But we don't need very big curtains. We cut them with very small curtains. Often it's the rejects. And then it is dried for two years before we can start to work it. Then we turn them for two years before we can start to work it. Then we turn them for two years before we can start to work it. Then we turn them them, dye them and varnish them. On tourne, on les That's already varnished. Voilà, et on les varnish. Yes. Voilà. Oui. The beads that are outside of the house oui, need to be qui sont appelés à être à l'extérieur donc pour se protéger quand même oui. des intempéries. It's a work of patience. <laughs> How long does a curtain like that last? For life. From one generation to another. Oui. 